Hello everybody and welcome to another edition of Drew's Food Reviews. And today I've got another episode and I'm going to call this one Too Sweet because it is sort of a sweet thing. I guess it could have been What's New or the Search for Snacks because it is a snack. But I'm going to call it Too Sweet because it's technically a sweet, it's a pie sort of thing. <laughs> I found this at Walmart and this is a Walmart exclusive flavor and as far as I know they only had it in the big pack and <clears throat> I've tried some of these before and I don't know how it's going to be but I'm going to try it. I'm not going to try it in a toaster. I'm not going to microwave it or whatever. I'm just going to try it like it's supposed to be and this is called this is from Pop-Tarts and it's called Frosted Crisp Apple and what this is is it's a Pop tart, and it's got the it says naturally and artificially flavored. Okay, and that's all it is. I guess it's a frosted crisp apple, and I guess it's got apple filling in the middle, and then the little thing on the back. Fully baked, ready to eat. It says you could do it in the toaster, you could do it in the microwave, or you can just eat them plain, and that's what I'm gonna try. Sometimes you could put them in the microwave for like five seconds, ten seconds, or you could put them in the toaster. And when you put them in the toaster, they get kind of hard and crunchy and whatever. So I don't know. It's not, not my thing. So for wow, one pastry is 200 calories. So that's kind of high for just one. And they normally come in the little, in the pouches, and then it's in two packs. So, I've got 400 calories. Go ahead and open it, and I'll get one of the packs open. So when you go, open it up, and get the pack open if I can. I'm trying to be all scientific here. And, These are a little bit different than I kind of remember. I used to think they used to be like a, I don't remember how they used to be, but foil or whatever. Here you go. This is frosted here. See it? And it's got the, I can certainly smell that it is like a, Granny Smith kind of apple, and I'll go ahead and break it open for you guys, so you can see on the inside. And here we go. I'll try it just on its own. I don't know that I want to microwave it. <laughs> All it does is get it a little bit soft. If you want to do that, you can do it. Here we go. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. The apple filling, I wish it would be a little more. It's pretty good. The frosting on the top is pretty good. It is tasting like Granny Smith kind of apple. Hmm. Not bad at all. That apple filling is really good. I can taste it like a Granny Smith, like a apple sauce or an apple kind of apple pie. It's really good. The frosting on the top is pretty good. It's good all around. I would probably get that again, but again, it's also only at Walmart and I think this pack ran me like $3.69 or something. Maybe they'll have it in the smaller packs later. Hmm. I'm not sure. Yeah, it's actually pretty good. Zap it in the microwave for about 10 seconds and you're good. Or put it in the toaster, but when you put it in the toaster, it gets a little bit too uh, crisp and too hard. 
and it's good just to have it the packet. So for the crisp apple pop tarts from Walmart, give those a nine out of 11. It's really good, it's actually good. Normally I like the, the chocolate or the berry ones, but this one, this apple, and I've actually got the old one, the Jolly Rancher apple. I still got a case of that, and that's a little bit different. That's a little more intense. That's like the Jolly Rancher candy, and that was actually pretty good, and I think they've since discontinued that, and I still have a, still have a box of it that I haven't even opened, but this is actually pretty good because it's not real sour. It's a little bit sweet. And yeah, it's pretty good. So I would say if you like apple, if you like Pop-Tarts, you like a little quick snack on the go, pop on down to Walmart and check out the Pop-Tarts. They've also got Pop-Tart snacks. They've got Pop-Tart cereal. And I think it was Pop Tart Bar. So they've got all kinds of pop pop tart things popping up. So if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to hit the subscribe and the notification bell right over there. That way you won't miss any future content. And you'll see when I go live. You'll also you can go through my library and check out my past reviews of I did some other Pop Tart ones out there. For, from the past, um, uh, lots of different snacks, sweets, treats, sodas, everything, a little bit of something for everybody out there. So till next time on Drew's Food Reviews, when I'll be trying something new and exciting in the food review world. I'll talk to you later. And I'm gonna go ahead and finish this off because it's actually pretty good. So till next time, <laughs> And you can pop on by. So, till next time, talk to you later.